welcome everyone uh, so this is creative Venus, and today we will learn how to design this beautiful morph animation uh, in microsoft powerpoint and it is really easy to design such kind of slides that will be helpful for your business and corporate presentations so before moving further uh, please watch this video editing text or images in pdf has always been a challenge the all-in-new PDF Element 7 from Wondershare has recognized this factor and it really works like magic. You can easily edit text and images with the help of this awesome software. The editing tool in the PDF Element 7 are so intuitive and easy to use that it works amazingly. If you want to know more about the all-in-new PDF Element 7 from Wondershare, refer to the links in the video description. So in today's video we will learn how to design this beautiful infographic slide and in this infographic the design that we are using is bulb so bulb signifies idea innovation thought vision so those kind of things so this is a multi-purpose template which you can use for any purpose it could be a process workflow diagram anything so here you can see we have inserted a square and this shape here now we are using edit shapes op option to create a curve on the left side now we will subtract the right side of the shape now duplicate it rotate horizontally place it like this now select both the shapes and select union now you have got this beautiful shape here now select both the shapes and press union a balloon like shape has appeared now so you are closer to creating an electric bulb here of course bulbs are electric so the bottom part is a bit long so I have subtracted it now it is looking fine now insert this rounded rectangle now we are creating the bottom part which goes inside the bulb holder when you rotate the bulb for that part you need to create these kind of shapes so subtract it from the left again duplicate this and use it here now subtract it so you can see on a screen right now now fast forwarded the videos because we have repeated the steps here now you have got this shape here now comes the next part which is coloring so this bottom part is always of metallic color so we will fill metallic gradient here and i have explained it my explained it in my previous videos at, as well how to fill gradient but this time we are filling metallic gradient which requires six gradient stops as you can see on your screen right now so once it's done on the one shape select the shape select format painter and apply the effect on other shapes as well now we need to fill the gradient in the orange shapes as well but this time the gradient will be much darker because this part is a bit lower than the other parts of this shape so 3d kind of effect is now coming out and it is looking much more realistic now and that should be the beauty of your design that every design should look real that you would want to touch the design with your hands so that should be the reality in it so 
so now you can see the bottom part is almost ready now we need to design the connectors here for that you need this kind of small shape a rounded rectangle will look good I'll place it here and send to back now duplicate it and place the second connector here now we will fill the dark color on these connectors because these are not of orange colors as you can see on any bulb now create these rectangles here so if you want to create a six steps infographics or five steps so those for those kind of infographics you need either five rectangles here or six so here you can see we are dividing the bulb into six parts here once all this all these rectangles are selected make sure these are center and middle aligned now send these two back ungroup now select this bulb blue shaped shape and duplicate it by six times now select all these blue shapes and deselect other shapes now align middle align center and place it like this so we have these six rectangles and six blue shapes and we will select one by one one rectangle one blue shape and intersect now second rectangle another blue shape intersect third blue shape intersect and repeat the process for all these rectangles so now this bulb is divided into six part remove this extra blue shape so the bulb comprises of these six beautiful infographic shapes now we will fill the colors filling color is very easy we will fill gradient color on one node we will put a dark color on the second node we will put light color dark blue light blue a beautiful effect will appear once you will do this kind of color scheme I mean when you will apply such color scheme it looks good one dark one light now we we just need to change the angle of these colors but before that on the last part we will fill pattern so this is a very smart bulb this is not a traditional bulb that's why we have filled pattern on the lower most part so we have changed the direction of the gradients from top to bottom to left to right so now you can see on your screen this bulb is looking really beautiful vibrant bright so you don't have to follow or go with my color scheme you can use your own color palettes here also you can change the background from white to black or dark blue or you can also apply a background image make sure it's a bit transparent so that this subject is visible now insert this circle shape and send it to back remove its outline now let's fill the gradient color here 
white on the one gradient stop on on the second gradient stop fill a light blue color apply shadow effect increase the blurness and change the shadow color to light blue so now it's looking really beautiful let's add few icons here so icons tab is there in this office 365 version if you don't have this tab you can download the icons from various online sources make sure the icons are well aligned alignment is very important in powerpoint presentations and it contributes a lot in the beauty of any design so alignment is very important so while you are watching this video you can also press the subscribe button and like button so that will really help us so I am aligning these icons here so that these are center lined so my most of the time goes into polishing and aligning the components on any slide and it is very important so now duplicate the slide here now this is second number slide and what we will do here is we are preparing a morph animation so on the first slide only the topmost part of the bulb which is blue that will be uh, that will be you know left with color rest of the part of this bulb will be grayed out so we want to showcase here that this is a five step process where this is the first step of the process so that's why only topmost part is visible which is the first part and on the right side it's a playground you can add any information you want you can showcase your st uh, facts stats some bullet points numbers paragraphs anything you want to showcase here so it is pretty easy and you know how to add text make sure it is well aligned so I'm also adding some number here just for you know filling the space text designing is also an art you just can't place text randomly you have to put your time and effort in making sure that it is looking beautiful at the end and you can easily read and understand the text which is really important I've seen presentation slides where text is placed like it has been placed in some kind of literature so always ensure that text is minimal and only important stuff is placed on the slide So, our, so we have duplicated the slide now we are on the third slide where we will color the second part as well and we will keep rest of, rest of the part grayed out and similarly you can design third fourth and fifth slide so once it's done select all the slides and select morph under transition step and then you will have this beautiful final result a beautiful business infographic morph animated presentation slide deck you can use this for your pitch decks achievement reports sales reports proposals rfps and all that so in the end i would like to say please subscribe to our channel join the membership and share your thoughts in the comment section also click on the notification icon so that you will get 
uh, notified whenever I will upload my video. So please keep sharing your love and support as you are as you have always done. So thank you everyone to let me know how to how do you like this video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.